Tika Tika Taking of the Dick. Here is a SJ35 shooter, which is quite popular for kind of applications. And uh, the lens and diameter ratio is 28. Uh, this is a standard SJ35. The larger size SJ is 45, SJ50, SJ66, 65. Yeah. But today's topic is about the desktop type SJ15, SJ25, and SJ35 from Robotic. Here you can see there are four extruders, the desktop type from Robotic. And uh, on the right, on the right, that one, uh, with speed motor, uh, AC torque motor, which is standard. The standard one is vertical type, and uh, this motor is stable jet motor. Okay, you can see there is a step motor with planetary gear, and it could be horizontal, but uh, this one is vertical. We make it vertical, and then uh, the pallet. Uh, input is just uh, from uh, from vertical type, and you can see the third one. The third one is uh, high temperature. Wheel temperature could be reach uh, six hundred, and uh, the motor. Uh, I just want to mention the motor. The motor is servo motor. Summer motor with planetary gear. So from the right to the third is AC a torque motor. It's also with gearbox. And this one is stem motor with planetary gear, and the third one is summer motor. So the the price is different because of the motor and also the control unit okay also different temperature request so uh you know uh, they are customizable and you can check for price and your application so when it comes to the force on the left the left one is uh desktop the LD ratio, length and diameter ratio, is 28. So, compared with the floor type, and this one is just a top type. And uh, it has a 4K AC motor, a 4K W AC motor, and it's controlled by, uh, within the control box, there is a, a VFD. Uh, there is an inverter uh, ver verified uh, frequency drive. Okay. Uh, yeah, that's why we have uh, just only uh, 22. But this one, 4KW, there are 120 uh, voltage uh, version. I mean, there were two versions for. Uh, for US or for Europe, okay. So you can find all this on Robotic, and uh, if you have any questions, please let us know. Um, I will show you about the vertical tie, how the pallet get into the extruder. It uh, just uh, as mentioned is step motor, so I think you can get that off 
on your x y uh, for a frame i mean uh, you can it, it can be used for palette 3d printing if you have a larger xyz uh, platform for such uh, extruder by the way you also can have uh, other size smaller size uh, 8 12 16 20 screw and diameter a uh, screw and the barrel or uh, it's a cylinder uh, from rob the dick to build your own extruder or pallet 3d printer thanks for watching yeah